Hey, hey, you're gonna like this one. Seven riddles that will test your brain power. Our brain is a mysterious thing. We know more about stars than about the things inside our heads. But what we do know about the brain is that it gets less sharp and productive with age. Uh, what'd you say? Never mind. Do you want to test your brain power and calculate its approximate age? Watch this video till the end to find out the results. You have a maximum of 20 seconds for each task, but try to answer the questions as fast as possible. Counting down, here's test number 7. Take a very close look at these two photographs. What is the mistake they have in common? If you still can't figure it out, let's turn the photos upside down. It looks horrible, right? The eyes and lips of both women are upside down. But your brain doesn't recognize that immediately. The thing is, the brain is not used to seeing eyes and lips in that position. There is another interesting experiment. Some people can turn their tongues upside down. Like, ugh. Hit the like button if you are one of them. If you can, do it and touch the left side of your tongue. It will sense the touch from the opposite side, because evolution never taught the brain to read the sensations on the tongue in that position. Ugh, that's weird. Test number 6. How many holes does this t-shirt have? What, mine? Oh, oh, the one on the screen. Never mind. The question doesn't specify which holes exactly, so the right answer is 8. They are the neckline, two sleeves, the bottom of the t-shirt, and four holes in the middle. Two in the front and two in the back, because we can see the background through them. Test number 5. How would you name this tree? Write the names that came to your mind in the comment section below. But the actual challenge was to notice the camouflaged bird on the tree. If you did, well done! Test number 4 Can you manage this one in 5 seconds? I'll give you 20 seconds, but try to solve it as fast as possible. The mistake is not in the numbers or their colors. The mistake is that the word spot appears twice. Your brain doesn't always show you the reality. It often shows what it is used to. There are many short texts on the internet that have repeating words that most people don't notice until they finish the text and read the description. If you have bad eyes, you might have noticed that things, most often words, you couldn't see from a distance, become clearer when somebody tells you what's written there. It's not that your eyes became better, it's your brain completes the picture. Test number 3 Do you see a hidden baby? No, that's not mine either. If you follow the thin branches of the tree, you will see the outline of a baby in the fetal position. Its feet and toes are on the right side of the picture, arms are in the middle, and head is on the left. Uh, one more thing. 
It's good that he doesn't have teeth because his bark is better than his bite. <laughs> Test number two. Which line is longer? Of course, line A is longer. It's so obvious, right? Well, not for everybody. Or rather, not always. There was a research on conformity that looked like this. Five people were asked which of two lines was longer. The answer was always simple. But four of the tested people were asked to lie. So technically, there was only one real subject. The people lied very convincingly. So the subject didn't want to stand out and gave the wrong answer. The same phenomenon can be illustrated with jokes. If you're in a group of people and somebody tells a joke that everybody finds funny, you will laugh too, even if you don't get it or don't think it's funny. Well, maybe not you, but approximately 75% of people do so. Of course, everybody laughs at my jokes, right? <laughs> Liars. Alright, test number one. Can you spot Mike Wazowski? There he is! Green, but still very different. Now, let's talk about your results. If it took you more than 20 seconds to answer each question, or you didn't manage all the tasks, it means that you have the brain of a mature person. It's hard for you to make your mind see beyond the obvious, and you can't handle change easily. Wow! If it took you less than 20 seconds, your brain is quite young, and you can approach tasks from different angles. If you answered each question correctly in less than 5 seconds, your brain is very young and flexible. You can notice the tiniest details right away and adapt to new situations easily. As for those of us with mature brains, hey, don't worry. As the saying goes, you're only young once, but you can be immature forever. So, what is your result? Tell us in the comment section below. Like this video and share it with your friends to compare your results. And see you back here next time on The Bright Side of Life.